Hello everyone, this is Garrett, and today is Halloween, where only the spookiest and scariest of evil monsters are coming out to play Bobby. Fortunately, or unfortunately rather, we don't celebrate Halloween in the Netherlands. So I'm just gonna play this as a regular old game, even though that icon looks incredibly scary, and I'm actually terrified already. So this is Bobby, jet set and style for the Nintendo Wii, and it is beautiful. And I have only tried out practice mode so far, which lets you practice certain things I guess you do in the game, but that's not important because we are gonna play a game right now. The options only have sound options, and they're not very exciting. Ooh. Are you ready to travel the world and meet all kinds of new people? Great! Yes, this sounds like something I wish to do. I can tell you have tons of potential, so oh, let's thank get started. You. What's a fashionista, you ask? Probably something you're going to tell me right now, but it's still probably a made-up word. My fashionistas are the world's premier stylists. Whenever there's a fashion emergency, we come to the rescue. Whether it's hairstyling, makeup, nails, or clothing, it'll be up to you to save the day. I am here to save the day from fashion disasters this spooky Halloween. Don't worry, I'll be traveling with you in my jet salon. I have a huge fashion show in Milan, Italy coming up. Jet I'll be salon? For some great additions for the show from around the world. Jet salon. Is that really what it sounds like? Also, he's still moving her mouth. Who is she even talking to? Like, every now and then, it just looks like she just looks far into the distance. It's like, hmm. Wait, what's, what's going on over there? Ugh, go away. And then she just looks back at me like, ah. Let's go ahead and start to learn the basics. Come with me. I will learn all the basics of L.A. Also, this game seems to have the same amount of loading screens as that Glam Gloom Clop Plop Plops game. So there we go. Fashion emergency. A fashion emergency. You can also check out the blog from here using this button. Flag. To start traveling, just scroll to the desired location. <laughs> from the looks of it, the desired location is the only place we can go if any of these other tickets, I guess, are. To have to learn the basics uh. and earn style points before we start to work in other cities. There we go. <laughs> I was wondering when the great explanation was coming as to why we can only go to Los Angeles. But let's go to check our blog. I wonder what's in our blog so far. I'm truly curious. You can always come to my blog to read up on what's going on, see comments from clients, and keep up to date. Let's see what's up. <laughs> and what is up is um nothing. Yeah, that's just a lot of like grayed out stuff and nothing. Not even one of those posts that says, oh, I'm, I'm sorry I haven't posted in quite some time. Uh, I've been very busy, and uh, I just haven't had time to write in my blog. Like every blog in ever existing everness. Ever. But let's go to Los Angeles and do some fashioniting. Fashionisti coating. What is that word to you? Fashionitis? I don't know. requesting a new hairstyle. This will be the perfect opportunity to teach you some basics. What a great opportunity you have given me. She's barely wearing clothes. But you know, that's why we're the fashion experts to learn all the new things about fashion hiding. This is the hairstyle selection screen. Not all hairstyles are available right away, and sometimes clients request a specific style. First, select the desired hair length. <clears throat> then, select the desired style. I don't really have a... Let's go style some hair. I don't really have an extremely large short amount of hair. choice hair. Yeah, do I have short hair and... Well, I guess I have different types of... Well, I have two types of short hair. It's like... Old-fashioned. And... I'm not sure because I can't actually spin the camera around it seems. So we're going with this because I'm curious what this is going to end up as. It already starting off so well. Welcome to my private jet salon. We don't just fly in style, we fly and style. <laughs> so yeah, they were not kidding about a jet salon. They literally kidnap these people so they can do their hair. So our client here has requested a style that requires a haircut. Let's learn how to do that. Oh, thanks, Bobby. I really do let's want to know. Let's brush the strip. Wii motion. Well, I actually had to move my my, my Wii mode there. That was strange. Strip of hair to the desired length. 
I got the feeling that brushing that hair did not really have any effect at all, but I feel like doing it helped me regardless. Okay. Okay, this... I, I'm guessing I have to hit it in the yellow bit, but I think this is close enough. Now use the scissors to cut the hair. Yes, this will be a beautifully artistic hairstyle. This is very short. That's all there is to it. That is all there is to it. To earn a higher score. Quick I and precise. The rest. Try to cut each strip the right length so the hair isn't uneven. Oh, yeah, it actually looks like there's a timer in the top left there. I'm gonna have to do this like 15 times. I play the practice mode of this, and it's like, uh, although one thing I'm pretty amazing about the practice mode was that you have actual difficulties ranging from easy to extreme. So if you ever want to do some extreme hair salon ringing, then this will be the game of your choice. Also, I am truly making this the most fantastic hairstyle anyone has ever seen in their entire life. Exactly even. Just as the client ordered. Okay, let's do this perfectly. Yeah! Right in the middle of the pink and yellow thingy thingy. Now, I honestly don't think anyone can criticize this hairstyle. Like, I think this is basically perfect. So, I'm just gonna make it just a little bit in that direction. At least you can make it like longer and shorter, like if you miss it. So, that's a good thing, I guess. Praising this game already because of its greatness. So I feel kind of bad for this person. But that's what you get when you ask me to be her hairdresser. But at least we got three magical gold Barbie trademark coins. I like how the trademark symbol is about as, is about as big as, like, the coin, but, you know. Some it's important to have your... Ah. The curl meter. Uh-huh. Like this is one of those games that's just gonna really hurt your arms in the end for no real reason. And, oh, no it isn't. <laughs> um, so yeah, it looks like you have to spin the Wiimo, but actually you just have to tilted sideways slightly, and that's enough, so, yeah. Also pretty sure <laughs> this wouldn't work. Like, I'm pretty sure if you just instantly removed it, it would just go flop all the way back down again. But apparently it's flawless and got us five Barbie coins, which I don't actually know what it does. You're giving me the option of giving her a hair color. Well, sometimes add streaks or highlights to the hairstyle with a secondary color. I actually um, tried this in practice mode as well. A final look. I do that. And there was like an extra button here for highlights, but that's not there. So I guess she doesn't want highlights, but she does want me to pick an amazing color. Like blue or green. I think that really suits her. Let's see, blue. I also vaguely remember there being something really weird with this, like... If you did certain combinations, it would just randomly go black. Oh god, that's pink. Like that. I, I used two white dyes, and it turned entirely black. And if I use white again, it's gonna stay black. Like No matter how, no matter how much white dye I use from this point, it, this will be the color. I wonder if I can get that crazy pink color again. How do I do that? I have like blue, black, and then white. No, not me. Ah, this is gonna torture me. Come on, let's do this again. Blue, blue. Red, maybe white now? Yeah! This is clearly the color you were going for. The moment you stepped into my plane to get your hair done. And now, she does the fashion dance. Because once your hair is styled, you must show it off in the land of pink stars floating in the background while... Oh yeah, the green nails. I had something to do with that. Yes. Yes, definite. Where is she? Where is this? Like, does Barbie just have a room with stars everywhere? Just in case you ever got your hair cut in her plane, then I guess you can do that. Wow. Sure. Wow! That's my first impression when I saw that hairstyle. It looks kind of weird. Not even just because of the color, just because of the style. Cards? Cards! Cards. Is this a memory game? This feels like a memory game. I'm really bad at memory games. Like, my memory is, like, awful. It is usually pretty bad, so this... These kind of things might take me a while. Uh, unless it just gives me all the answers immediately. That's kind of nice, I guess. 
Yes, I only made a few mistakes and I really didn't have much choice there, but I got a dress, I guess. New fashion design to work with. Yes. Green. Our new fashion design is green with a blue flower as a belt. Does anyone ever actually have like flower belts? I've never seen those, I don't think. She really needs some help with her look before the big event. Oh my god. Well, I am known as being a prime fashion -odie. Also, I don't think that horrible haircut I gave her actually had any effect on like what the final product was. It seemed to just kind of be there just for kicks. But you know, what do I know? I am only a beginning fashion -odo. Oh, that person looks incredibly famous and looks like she has a large audience she's waving to right now. Mm -hmm. Lisa, it's been forever. Yeah, because you walk incredibly slowly. Totally, like Telly. You've been nominated for best actress. Whoa. That's so spectacular. She got nominated for best actress ever by the best actress committee. I know, I still can't believe it. It's all just happening so fast. That's probably because you're not living in a real world. Your background is entirely cartoon. You're not real. Who's this? Oh, I'm just the best fashion designer ever. Have you met my awesome new fashion stylist yet? See, even Bebe says it, so if Bebe says it, then truly it must be so. So glad I brought you. You're gonna be a huge help. Have you seen my previous works? You're gonna get a hairstyle really of the new you. world. I'm thinking of going for zombie apocalypse. Oh yes. I would be if I wasn't so nervous. I've never been nominated for a lead role before, and I have to look awesome. This is usually the dance I do when I'm nervous. Like I continue dancing and moving my mouth after I'm done talking. That's really strange. Like they didn't even bother. Oh Bobby. Oh Bobby. But I've been Why? so busy with everything that I'm now in a major fashion crisis. I need a new look and fast. Yes, you clearly don't look like a human being. You look like you had a fashion crisis. Well, to be fair, like, Barbie seems to be dressed for an entirely different weather than you are, but what don't do I know, right? It. We're here to the rescue. You're gonna look phenomenal, I promise. No one will ever recognize you. Savers. Yeah, if I didn't look good for prom, oh my god, like, my life would totally be over, and I don't, I just couldn't get, oh my god. Oh, I actually have hair, like, choices now. Okay, the medium... Medium hair. Me me medium, medium hair. Has no arrows here, so this is the medium Short. hair, I guess. Short is still these long two, but long hair. is messy. Uh, and isn't this, like, the generic Barbie hairstyle? Like, the one they had in back in the days, or is this or something else? I don't even know. Pigtails. Let's go with ultra generic Barbie hairstyle. It actually looks like one of those generic Barbie dolls from back in them days. I'm gonna do to have to do the exact same thing again. It does appear so. Is there a Barbie symbol on that brush? Hmm. I think we must investigate this more thoroughly once we see it. Yes. Oh my god! <laughs> I just see the Barbie symbol, but now I actually also realize that this person has no reflection based on the mirror right in front of her. But, you know, this is Halloween, so sometimes you have to give a vampire a haircut. So, you know, once you're in your magic plane giving vampires haircuts in the middle of the sky, then um, this is... Yeah. So, yeah, if you ever won the game where you give haircuts vam haircuts vampires... If you ever get won the game where you give vampires a haircut, this is the game for you. But... I can see why that is kind of a niche marketing campaign. But I think they should go with that. I think that would be a pretty good marketing campaign. Like, yes, have you ever wanted to see Twilight Reborn? Only now in the plane. It was, this is, I don't even know where I'm going with this. Let's just go with it. Ah, four coins. So I get three coins if I destroy it. And four if I hit everyone perfectly. Uh, I can see how that works. Yeah. So yeah, I'm literally not even moving this. <laughs> <laughs> right now, I was just already holding it sideways because uh, there's no. Sure, uh, I like how you can. Oh no, wait, that's not the Wiimote in the reflection. That looked really weird. For a second, I thought the Wiimote was in the reflection, but then I remembered it's not actually a mirror. 
Well, it is, but, you know, vampires and all that. I guess the Wiimote is a vampire as well. And also the person taking out these curlers. I wish you had curlers where you didn't have to wait ever. Like, you just take them out and it's like, done. Yeah. That would be so convenient. Right. Uh, let's go. Since it's a movie premiere, you have to look stunning. So let's go. Wow. Genosis. That looks perfect. You look uh, like a brand new model. Everyone would throw themselves at you. Is this going to be the exact same thing? I guess this is like the fashion dance. Like It really is the fashion dance. Like Once you have done Barbie Jetnosis, then you have to do this dance. And show off your nails, of course, because I spent a lot of work on those. You have no idea. What are you even doing? Who are you even looking at? It looks... I'm going to... Can I skip this? Uh... I don't know if I just skipped it or if it was just done because I think it was just at the end there. Oh, so many questions. Wow, that me? I don't believe it. That's usually what people say when you ask me to do their hair. Believe it. It's totally you. Oh God! Why? Why did you do this to me, Bobby? Thank you so much. You guys weren't kidding. Well, I did say no one would ever recognize you, so there you go. Also, did we just make her hair so much longer? <laughs> This premiere is gonna be a blast. Yes, I'm so looking forward to it. it. Oh so my god. You. Yeah, you do. Well, would you like to come to my global glam fashion show? It'd be great for you to make an appearance. Global glam fashion show. That sounds fab. Poptastic. Well, don't mind the press following me all over the place. Did I mention I'm really important? You have no idea, but I'm being followed everywhere. Do you see that black shadow person in the background there to the left? That is one of my press members. The more press, the better. Yes, more shadow Wouldn't people. Wouldn't miss it for the world. I'll also bring whatever props and spotlights you need. Ooh, and the red carpet. You're going to bring the red carpet. You just have one lying around, I guess, because... Well, the... Uh, you would think that if, like, Barbara Bobby ho hosts a fashion show that she would have, like, things. But I guess Thanks not. so much. Totally glamorific. Glamorific. <laughs> That's the word I'm going to use in real life from now on. I think people will appreciate me doing that. Glamorific. I wonder if I can check my blog. At yes! More memory games! I was just hoping we'd get another one. Oh. Yeah. Combine those paddles or whatever they are. Wow, I'm really good at this apparently. Ah, oh, I failed one. And I actually briefly forgot which one it was. Yeah, get rid of those ties or shoes or whatever they may be, and Super we unlock cute. Bobby. <laughs> Super cute. Hey, Man, you have no. Have a new style just oh for my you. God. I guess this relates to the hairstyle rather than the outfit, because the outfit looks like someone just took, like, I don't know, and then just threw bleach all over it for a while. Like, not even threw a little bit of bleach, but just all the bleach. It... Uh, I don't even have words for your outfit right now. Oh, I can switch between things now. I think I'll go to New York City, but first I'm going to check my blog. Because it's blinking at me, so it clearly wants to tell me something. Another day, another fashion crisis averted. Getting Eliza prepared for a big movie premiere was a blast, and I can't wait to hear how things went. In other news, Eliza will be bringing the red carpet lights and props with her to the global glam fashion show. Not to mention the publicity she'll bring. All in all, an absolutely fab day. Uh, what is this? The entire screen went black. Oh, wait. That's actually just my computer. Ah, the joys of screensavers. I should probably fix that. But, oh, well. Yes, there's a great picture of her and her looking ominously to the top left. She looks almost bald in this. Like, it looks like she's clearly wearing a wig. Which would actually explain things because she, her hair looked entirely different. Before the... I don't even know. Let's just go. What else? I guess... Okay, so we got the red carpet, spotlight, and stars. So that's one of nine... Do we seriously have to get nine things? It's going to take forever. Unless uh, it doesn't take very long. I don't know. Let's click on New York City. Let's go to New York. 